Hello guys, welcome to CRNT Designers, Chetan here. In this tutorial, we are going to learn different camera angles in cinematography. If you want to make any animation, then you should know these camera angles. Different camera angles are very useful to express story. For storytelling, camera angles express emotion, location, so the viewer can understand about the scene very well. I am a Blender lover, so I will go with the Blender software. I have used the Blender official film Spring to explain this camera angles. So are you ready for it? Let's get started. The first camera angle is wide shot. Wide shot is usually used to shoot the surrounding particular location so the viewer can understand where the scene has taken a place and it also used to express the loneliness emotion. The second camera angle is the long shot. It's also used to establish the location but in it you need to give more focus on your subject. You need to cover frame with the whole body of your subject. The third camera angle is the medium shot. Medium shot is used to focus what your subject is doing. This shot express that viewer is close to subject because the medium shot is usually used to view the distance between the viewer and subject. The fourth camera angle is the cowboy shot. The cowboy shot is in between the medium and long shot. If you want to show the details around your subject and your subject also have in focus, that time you can use the cowboy shot. The fifth camera angle is the close up shot. In the close up shot, you need to focus on head and shoulder of your subject. And this shot is mainly used for the dialogue and show the detailed expression of your subject. 50 to 100 mm focal length is very good for this close up shot. The sixth camera angle is detail or extreme close-up shot. Detail shot is used to emphasize on a specific detail thing in your image. Detail shot are extremely useful to create a depth and mystery in footage. And detail shot are best on the micro lens. The seventh camera angle is the low angle. Low angle is used to make your subject larger than life. And in same way, the low camera angle express that your subject is smaller than its surrounding. The 8th camera angle is the high angle. High angle is used to make your subject smaller and it express that your subject is weak or inferior. The 9th camera angle is the over the shoulder. When two subjects are talking to each other, that time you can place the camera above the one subject and to give that the perspective that you are talking. The 10th camera angle is the point of view. Point of view shot is used to express that what your subject is looking and this shot usually takes on the wide angle lens. By the way, I have made one tutorial on the studio light setup in Blender for commercial product shot. If you didn't watch that tutorial then I will give the link of that tutorial in the description box and i button also. So please watch that tutorial, it will definitely help you. Thanks for watching this tutorial. I hope it will help you to get the more knowledge about the different camera angles in cinematography. So you can use these camera angles in your animation to make your animation more beautiful and storyteller. So if you like this tutorial then hit that like button and subscribe my youtube channel. Thank you so much once again and see you in the next video. Bye bye.